Hey guys, welcome to Lillian's Couch. Today's episode, I have a very dear friend of mine. She's an actor, host, producer. She has a, her own show, which is doing very big. I mean, one of the biggest in Nigeria that we have right now. And if she's not your brand ambassador, hmm, I rest my case. Nancy Isime! <laughs> Hi, baby. Mm -hmm. How are Thank you? Thank you. You know, so you don't busy, my friend. So I did. I appreciate that you come. I know, no, no. Thank Happy you. To be here, baby girl. At least anytime Thank when I come, you're you sure. Of course. Congratulations. I pay me for all the money I spray for your bed, you know? I don't broke. I have plenty of money for my money back. When I see the money, I say, then I'll call you and you borrow me. <laughs> she could reply to the to the uh, video. The, the video. He was like, I don't beg. Give back my money. My sister, I don't say go pencil like this. Like, I, I almost call you the next day. I say, I bet if you borrow me like, at least one M. Because that money for that choke. He choke, man. But then that's because Nancy, you did good. I keep saying it. Most of the people I bring on this couch, and aside the fact that they are dear to me and everything, I have a personal relationship with them in terms of. We have our moments. I might not see Nancy in two months. We might not talk. Nancy's birthday was, maybe it's her birthday today. Nancy don't call me three. On my, Nancy call me on my birthday. They tell me I had a birthday. <laughs> three weeks. Like, we know when, when it's time, when we need each other, we know. We call. When I'm in, like my worst, Nancy was the first person to show up in my house. And Nancy came up, guy, you need to be strong. Don't be today. Like, forget this thing. You know? So I'm, I'm, I just want to say, well done. You've, you've grown. You keep growing. You keep exceeding the ex expectations. And as your friend, I'm proud. Because when I see people talk about you, ah, that's my friend. <laughs> uh, uh, let me call her. Hold on. I'll put it on that stick. Say, yeah, well, it's her. When you hear her laughter, you know it's her, right? <laughs> Nancy, oh. well done. If you were to describe your life right now as a title, like maybe a book or something, what would it be and why? Hmm, a book. Book where I don't read before, just, you know, it's just any, it can any, be any it title, can be anything, baby. Any you, any title or maybe at peace. Hmm. That would be that would definitely be a title. Why? I mean, I'm just at a point in my life where, you know, I'm just at peace. I'm at peace with my success, at peace with my accomplishments, at peace with my failures, at peace with my disappointments, at peace with my life entirely, with everything that's happening. Because I've come to a point in my life where I understand that everything is for a purpose. You get like one in journey and it can't always be smooth. So I'm at peace with the fact that challenges are just, it's just another step board to like another level. So I'm, I'm enjoying life. I, I, I'm so happy that we are in this place that we are because it's a very strong place to be. But Nancy, you, when did you get to this point, this point you are? Because I know that obviously we've all gone through that phase of that dark place where we are, I don't tire. Like, what is happening? How did you get to this strong place that you are? Because these people sometimes, they don't know that we go through it all. Mm -hmm. They don't know that sometimes you have to be on set, but you just break up with your some person where you love, or maybe something, one, just maybe your papa day hospital. Or, because I remember when my dad was in the hospital, so I was literally flying to Benin, coming back, and I was filming my own production. Mm -hmm. So it was, I was literally like a mad person. But then, once they say action, my sister, nobody gives a who to action. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It means you have to drop everything and be in that in moment. Character. So like, how did you get to this strong place? Because mm -hmm. this is a very strong place to be. Yeah, it's a strong place, but it's also a learning place. Like I, I know, it prob I look tough. You know, I am tough because I've been through so much, especially from childhood all the way till now. So I've had so many years experience and that's why I'm so thankful for my journey and thankful for my kind of success because it's like grassroots success. Mm -hmm. And there's not a lot of people who are patient enough mm -hmm. to have grassroots success, you know? Mm -hmm. Thank you, babes. There's not a lot of people who are patient enough to have grassroots success and that's the route I took. And it wasn't like I was even gunning for success at any point. I was just basically trying to work trying to be independent. I've always been a fan of independence. I've always wanted to be independent of everybody. Like at 16, I started working. Um, at 17, at 19, I'd moved out of my dad's house and I'd been completely responsible for myself at 19. Like when I say completely, I mean, even to my school fees, to my mm. toothbrush, to everything. And I was still sending money back home, taking care of the family. I remember one time my dad spoke to me and I was just, you know, sharing some fears. And he was like, whenever you're just in a setting space, just always remember that at the age of 18, you're already paying your younger sister's school fees. And I was like, that's huge. Don't remember that, but okay. And that's me. I, I do things for people all the time and I forget the moments I do. So they remind me later on and say, and that's why my birthdays are very 
special. That poor post I did on Instagram, I was shedding tears. And I remember I saw Alex and uh, uh, <laughs> Yomi. I said, you, you you no, no, act that thing. No, be script me that. And I was like, you try. And I saw you look for clouds finish. Now, Instagram, I'll come put myself. It was just a sincere feeling I was feeling at the moment. And it was, like I said, it was just things that people were writing. And I forget when I do things. I'm, I don't do things expecting anything in return, you know. So nothing is new under the sun. All our experiences are, are unique to ourselves, but they are very familiar. In a breakup, yeah, it doesn't matter the the, <laughs> the way you broke up. Somebody else has broken up and felt heartbroken. Forget about the circumstance, you know. Now, car you buy. I still don't buy the one with big bags. Do you understand? So for me, I don't think I'm entirely strong because I have my bad days. I have my moody days. I'm just myself. I'm just enjoying life. I'm just learning. I'm just listening to myself. Like if I come in here now, and my intuition, my spirit just stays away from somebody, I obey it. And don't understand? force it. I don't force myself on anybody. I used to be a child pleaser, but that comes from, I used to be a people's pleaser, but that came from childhood trauma. Did you understand? Mm -hmm. That came from childhood trauma, where attention, you're looking for attention as a child and you didn't get it. When you get older, you start wanting people to like you. So even if it's breaking you, even if you know that this person does not really like you and has said shit about you, you just, maybe they can change hey. their minds, you know, do you understand? But learning to love myself and be intuitive helped me start to heal that people's pleaser. I don't care about pleasing a single soul in this world. What is one of your most challenging roles so far? That like you say, mm -hmm. ah, this one, this one took me to this. I think I know it already, sort of. Really? Which one? Sort of. Which one? So it's not out, and will it be out before this interview comes? I don't the think the Netflix it'll be out. one, Blood Sisters. No, no, I don't think Blood. I think Shanty Town. Ah, Shanty Town. I think Shanty Town. Have you seen bits of it? Smells my smell. Smells my head. That's his mad. That's if you see yourself in one scene. I, I was having goosebumps. I was shaking. No way. I swear, when in, I was shaking. I was like, I was shaking. Once, ah, you, I see, I see, you see, I need to see. Watch. It's mad. I, need to go so I can't wait People, for it to come out. Ah, Chanty Town, guys. It's, I don't know if this interview will drop before it comes out. Yeah. In here, though, Ch Chichi and Wara, they did amazing. They did. And being on that project, I was inspired. Nancy, mm -hmm. seeing two women come together to do such an, a huge project. But that's what I'm thinking. But which, mm -hmm. which was it? Chanty Town. I mean, every, you know the funniest part, Nguyen? I'm so happy because every performance I do, critics say this is probably Nancy's best performance yet. And when I read it, I'm like, mm -hmm. wait till the next film. Okay. And the next film, of course, cinema release comes out and they're like, this is Nancy's best performance. <laughs> and that just shows where I am in my head. Always competing with myself, you know, better than the last performance. Uh, when critics say she's better than this person, they barely do it because I don't even give that energy. So they always compare me with my last self. It's just the energy I give out. When you want, when you spoke to me, I don't think you brought up other people. The first thing you said mm. is the years and where I am today. And I'm so grateful for that, that I've intentionally put that in people's heads just by being me. And people can just tell that this one is just here doing her thing. This one is just here, you know, trying to get a better life for herself. This one is not even looking at who's doing <laughs> what or who's not doing what. Yes, I'll congratulate you. I'm always even the last to hear things. I stay away from gossip blogs. I'm always the last. Medley sometimes will try to send some things to me in my gym. And then one time I was like, I really don't care. Mm -hmm. Every single day you are hearing what is happening to this, what is happening. So what time do you have to hear what's happening to you? What time do you have to hear your own problems? Because you have problems. So is it is it is it a a quick dose of solution but you still go back home at night and still cry about your own situation right yeah i do it's no matter how that person hey all these celebrities i talk calm now so then be all of them now shall oh thank god oh i'm just facing my small business then you think after saying that your small business automatically becomes prosperous <laughs> because a blogger just confirmed to you that every single woman is sleeping around you're entitled to your own opinion and that's okay so it's okay if you think, oh, oh I'm this way, or oh, Nancy is okay. You, mm -hmm. You're not in your wrong. You don't owe me to think I'm a perfect. It's mm -hmm. fine. Mm -hmm. If you know me, then you know who I am and what mm -hmm. I represent and what I stand for. And if you don't know, that's okay. Mm -hmm. But do you, like, in terms of your growing up, I know that obviously it, it made you toughen up and, you know, you obviously had your... But sometimes, do you, do, do you still change those things? Do they still come to play? Like, you know how sometimes those... Those things that you, your, your childhood upbringing, things, do they come, do they tell in your, who you are now? Obviously, uh, a lot of us, our behavior comes from like 
how we were brought up, you know. It's just like a behavioral pattern. Some of us decide to break out of it. Some of us still stay in it. But even if you try to break out of it, there's still parts of you. I don't feel, I don't feel like you should kill your inner child, no matter what the child went through. And that's one thing I try to keep alive in me, my inner child. And that's why people see me and say, oh, you're such a happy girl. Because kids really are happy people. They don't, they're not worried about the future. In order to function in the real life, I just go back to my inner child. And my inner child always takes me through, you know, because my inner child does not give two shits. Hmm. <laughs> so you, you know, yeah, you're laughing. You don't, you don't laugh at me. You don't, you don't say, yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. My inner child isn't sure what's happening. My inner child is just, you know, it's just here, just doing things. It's the adult in us that complicates things. I mean, yeah, I, I mean, I, I agree with you because for me, um, when I went through that phase and then I came out of it, I started, I knew the importance of guarding my mental health. I don't try to even, I don't try to go out of my way to see anything that would disrupt me, any negative thing. So I protect myself mentally. I think one of the issues with people really getting, you know, especially in your adult life, getting overwhelmed is just what other people think. And for people in the limelight, sometimes blogs might just cook up things that are not true. But me, I just, I just find solace in the fact that those who know me know me. Like I said before, the vibe I give out is simple. I'm here to walk. And even women that I look up to, they just always mention growth. And that's why I'm so thankful because the people, the younger girls who look up to me, you know, no matter what it comes their way, they can truly believe in the process of growth because it's so beautiful. And that's why I'm proud to be a student of life. Sweet. Okay, guys, it's time to dive in. I've been waiting for you to make a chop. Now to say you know the only stop calling me swanky because I know now because it's not necessary. Just lie to him. Just lie to him. What is this? His head is catching you. I told him I said we're about to run because he know they keep to time. My, I tell him I did it twenty twenty two. Say he tell me say it would change, but since I don't sure say the boy would change, but he's really trying because now he's still like two hours late. <laughs> so it's fine. Normally it's like five hours. So at least you don't wake up. So we'll soon be here. Anyways, guys, um, we're going into the food. Nancy says she's not hungry, but she got to chop with me. Fit fam people, all those in gym, gym, gym. No, Nancy make me I go re I register for gym. I, because we are going to register for gym. Yeah. One month, my money expire. I know I go two times. <laughs> I almost asked them for refund. When they send me email, say, hey, are you re renew? I say renew it. <laughs> I say we renew it. I don't want to do that kind of thing. <laughs> okay, guys. All right, we'll be right back. <laughs> what are you going to tell me from the other woman? Oh, no other woman. No, oh, you know the other woman. There's no other woman in my life. You are the only woman in my life. Then why do I know nothing about you? Why is it that the only thing I know about you is that your ex-wife left with your two kids? Why do you keep hiding me? You should say you know good job. Hmm. You know good test them. I'm going to go test them. <laughs> you know this, this baguette today, even though you're talking. And in the morning, I'll come to you, they do. Fit life does not mean you don't eat, so I don't know why that they get this. No, what's the last thing they do? That's battle room. Battle room. That's what you could do. I don't know, they see people where they walk out, not supposed to eat. Well, try. I don't know why you guys don't like to eat. Like, we eat. Guys, so Majority we, of us are foodies. So, okay, so then what? It will help us moderate the calories. All of us, ah, we they chop. So, do you guys, okay, that means you guys just fight it then. It's fitness, it's a lifestyle, it's not really, I don't think workout is for like becoming mm. something that's, you, anyway, you can, you, of course you can train your body as much as you want and mm -hmm. your strength level, but it even surpasses, it surpasses physicality, your mind, your strength mm -hmm. level, your yeah, stamina, especially for us that are in this entertainment business, so we're constantly on the go, mm -hmm. it's good to be fit and have stamina so that when the director says run from here to here, you won't be panting inside camera like mm -hmm. say one thing. And then just for the sake of a long life, I so when they say long I life and prosperity, I, I, don't do chop, I don't fit, do my, but I'm going to register again you and I'm going to be serious. Thing. I don't know if Ketensha is watching this, she's going to be laughing at me, but <laughs> the kids, I, I promise I'm going to make you proud, I'm going to be mm. serious. 2022. Then that's a nice. Mm. 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 Focus. Okay. I'm taking it from. I don't want one more prawn. Any <laughs> more prawn, miss? Because I promise you, I didn't do this. I cut half for me. Half small. Take this small. Okay, thank you. Madam Chef, <laughs> replace your Madam um, this thing. You know. mm. It's nice. No. Yeah. Spaghetti is even nicer. Nice. Mm. How have you been able to keep? Because it's not easy, relationship, everything, just day, day. Mm -hmm. How are you doing? You mean private? No. 
I think it's my upbringing, you know. I've just been, I'm very private. I've been private all my life, reserved. If you tell me secrets, I don't think anything you've ever told me, I don't think you've ever heard it anymore. Never. It's not my business to tell anybody. So me, I'm very, any experience, anything anybody tells me, I keep it to myself. So if I keep other people's secret, now I can't be my own, you know. And I've, I've, cracked, the, I've cracked some of the codes of life to know that <laughs> no matter how, the thing they do, mm -hmm. just one right. Mm. It's unnecessary. You understand? Just say I be the yeah, right just, before, I mean be right time. Most people don't write, oh, I don't, don't ever fall in love with D, D, D. Don't do, do. My sister, right time, right time. You're just giving people where they bored, but they, they just something to watch. But have you ever been in a situation where you got to, you, you experience heartbreak and you have to be on set or you have to work the next day? Have you ever been in that? Are you, have you ever been in that show? No. Heartbreak doesn't only come from relationship. Oh. Different things can break your heart. Family, expecting something, it doesn't mm -hmm. come. It's the same feeling. Let me hear. I have like the toughest wall behind my heart because what well, is like people don't do me things. Because <laughs> I was a child. People don't look me say, this one has soft teen, a nice girl. People do her things. Mm -hmm. What they don't know is that we prepare me for the future. <laughs> and I know you're anything. Nothing is new under the earth. <laughs> They break heart self before even they even break their heart because I'm very intuitive. I've already seen it coming. I just one thing I just use is gratitude. I use gratitude for what we've had, for what we've had, like for where we've been. And my work is my work. People we don't pay you money. I mean, if you pay me money for anything, when you they pay the money? No, because you say move this show from yesterday. We're meant to shoot it. Now say, boo, you know say. I see him. I don't want to refund this money. I don't say you love it. You, you say you pay me, you don't say money come on your account. You don't say you pay person. <laughs> so they pay that kind of thing and then I come on set and I'm using heartbreak everybody. Everybody's going through heartbreak. Everybody here is going through what they are going through. Everybody here is going through heartbreak. 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 I take a break. Maybe the goal is your play, play, so you play with your donkey. So like, nah, those enjoyment are, with those ones. Those are craft. Nah, enjoyment, though, but those ones, I could even, it could even be a house. I'll just, if I was supposed to book a project, I just stay away from projects, stay away from social media, and just go through it. Because it's life. You have to go through things to actually know how to not do it in the future. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. So, definitely. I don't. For me, when they do so many things, so mm -hmm. I get my own heartbreaks in different places. It's not. Some people are breaking only man. I get my outbreak. I'm a CEO, you know, I'm an executive producer. I own my own show, I run my own shit. Um, I'm an actor, I'm a host. I do a brand ambassadorship. There's so many things I do. So no, I did. It's your show. Your I show is because it's doing so well. Thank you, my when love. When you started, like, I'm sure you didn't expect it. It's doing so well. Like, okay. even me, I'm just like, okay, when I'm watching that. What you're doing is huge. First of all, you're the only, I mean, you're not the only one, but your type of show is unique to you. Mm -hmm. You've made it your own. It's mm -hmm. Nancy Simmons' show, it's mm -hmm. your show. So mm -hmm. you be able to put your, you know, elements and, mm -hmm. and, and you know, it's, it's, I don't know, it's, it's amazing. It's amazing. I know it's it gets overwhelming step. sometimes, right? All the time. Because you know, I know it's through, hard. Going through the emotions of creating, selling, putting together, you know. That entire show is my brainchild. Like, I, I mean, Every single minute comes from here. And even when post-production is happening, I'm still a very huge key of it. A huge part of post-production, you know. And just, it's passion for me. I love hosting. The, the reason for creating the show wasn't because I wanted to do one thing that somebody else is doing or come out and say, oh, everybody, look at what I'm doing now. It came from passion. It came from it's something I really love. It came from wanting to celebrate my celebrity friends and give mm -hmm. them a safe haven to talk and chill. Your, your show, it's, it's huge. And I can tell you, because coming from an executive producer angle and a producer, I know the work you put in that show. And it's, mm -hmm. it's looking great. And, and I bet you... Um, and I bet you it will only, that's just Amen. the start, How you, it's just your starting point, it's not the, it's just, it's going to be way bigger, Amen. like you're going to go so far. Amen. Why did they chop my panty? I don't know, I just did my own thing, just call me, I just carry on. The next time you don't enter my mouth. Wait, so man. You know, maybe this guest said, they got to say. Mm, you're praying, please. Why you stop praying? That's why you chop down my plantain, that's the way you come. Mm. You finish, I, bet. I don't even share plantain. Mm. If you chop anything, don't chop. You don't chop like four plates today. Why did you disgrace yourself? Don't be this case. Mm. 
<laughs> guys, this game just get one more food to chop on. <laughs> okay, guys, <laughs> guys, okay, we need to go into the games now. <laughs> I need to win this. Let this girl go drink shots <laughs> before she come move for the show. Mm. Yes. So the game we're playing is best of fives. They don't already explain to her before we start, Steph. <laughs> oh yeah. One, two, three, four. I did five. You did five? Yeah. One, two, three, two. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> Why are you screaming? Yeah, I'll do one more because <laughs> we all fit too. One, two, three, five. Let's start drink. <laughs> Can you cannot? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. <laughs> oh, wow. You bring a new wish comes this couch. You don't shake when you drink the shots. Five. Oh, yeah, you're tall. Should I tell them why? I need you. They're crazy. Are you using this? <laughs> oh, yeah, do your own. Will you be honest with them? Do your own. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Your turn now. One, two, three, two. No, no, no. You can't start this with rubbish. I can't. 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 I can no. I swear, she's not doing it the right way. No, she not doing it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. One, two, three, three. You see now. <laughs> no, I told I, you that you no, are cheating. No, this is my fate. No, that is my fate. They are drink. Not, I do give you four times. Those other times where you were cheating. <laughs> so cheating. That <laughs> <laughs> so I no, slap you out. Give me one more. You can't do that. One more try. Okay. One, two, three, five. <laughs> they are drink. Because you know what you just did. Wish. <laughs> Good to say you won't give her money for the game. <laughs> You don't want to fail on your own show. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. My turn. Oh. <laughs> no, that won't be the real show. You. Idiot! Stupid girl! <laughs> this girl, baby, 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 one, two, three, four. Fail. One, two, three, two. Uh -uh. One, two, three, five. Drink, 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 drink. Sorry, your phone. I know, say one more. One, two, three, six. How you do this? Six. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> you get finger where you want. Press me, come out. Me, see whether you get oh, yeah. six fingers. Oh, yeah. One, two, three, four. You fail, just drink, please. Mm. That's okay. One, two, three, three. <laughs> one, two, three, one. One, two, three, five. I got this one. That's, I got this one. No, I got this one. I got this one now. I, you, yeah, you, do your last one. Do your last one. Me, 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 do your last one. Me, 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 me. Do your last one. One, two, three, four. <laughs> I, I, I drink your shagel. Nancy, I, I don't have to. Nancy, you don't have any shots. I don't drink. I don't. Before you, I get like three guests. Nancy, I beg. It's okay. No, no, you do your house now. Fine, guys. Yeah, thank you so much. We forget this. I'm your host. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. Take your shots. Mm. Uh, I finished. Hmm. Did I give you my same shots? Ah. Uh -uh. The way you drank that shot. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Please do not forget to subscribe, like, share, drop a comment. Nancy. Thank you for coming on my Thank show. Thank you for having me. I love you. I love I you really too. Appreciate and congratulations, you. honestly. This is a great move. I love so far. Love you too. Okay, guys. Thank you so much. You know on Lillian's couch is eat, drink, and vibe. I love you all. <laughs>